Why did he take you again, Ellen? Was it because you were young? Because your eyes shone? And your lips smiled? Because you were life? It wasn't me tonight, Ellen. No. For all those years ago, it was Dr. Death. Dr. Death. Who is Dr. Death? Well, I will tell you. Herbert and I created him between us. No, we didn't create him, he was there. We found him in ourselves. We looked into the depths of our souls. And he was there. He was already there. And he will always be there. Who is Dr. Death? Well, I will tell you. Man is born to live! He creates life, he welcomes life, he cherishes life, he creates new life. But deep in our souls there lurks an instinct which welcomes death. It makes it easier when it comes. It isn't very strong, this death instinct. It's only needed once. That's what we saw in the darkness. That is the sleeping phantom that we... that we roused and formed and clothed in black. A phantom feeding on death, creating death, exulting in death! Oh, why didn't he take me and let you live? Now he must die. The Dr. Death that we created, he must die. I am not afraid. There is always room for more in the coffin of time. The instinct is alive within me. And you, Dr. Death, are you afraid? No. No, you're going home. Come. Lights! Camera! Action! Now I must play the final scene. The death of Dr. Death. <laughs> 